Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel and welcome to episode 147 of the Universe Mode series and welcome to Fight, ladies and gentlemen. This is the last episode of Fight of Season 1. It is the last episode of Fight before Extreme Mania and we are just counting down the days, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, but we are in Atlantic City, New Jersey, of course. Uh, Extreme Mania will be uh, at MetLife Stadium, so we are uh, in the general vicinity there. So... Um, <clears throat> but yeah, we are here for fight, the last episode, as I said before, Extreme Mania. Uh, and we're going to start things off here with the Extreme Championship that being defended in a ladder match. Um, so we're going to start things off here with a bang. And it looks like Fire Skull will be the one challenging here tonight. <coughs> former extreme champion in his own right. about to get this ladder match underway here you see it is for the extreme championship it is on the line as per usual and here we go the bell has been rung fire still with a side slam there to start things off <coughs> Oh, thrown into the corner there. Of course, the winner of this match is not guaranteed a, a, a match at Extreme Mania. Um, of course, they do have to. The winner does have to go on to uh, battle this weekend to defend their championship. But if uh, they can retain the title, if the winner of this match can retain the title at uh, on battle, they will be walking into Extreme Mania with the title. Um, but of course, that all, all depends on what happens. Uh, tonight and uh, tomorrow on that one. <coughs> but again, Extreme Mania is coming up very, very soon. Uh, like I was saying, this is the last episode of Fight before Extreme Mania. So we have Battle, then Evolve, and after that is Extreme Mania, uh, the biggest stage in the XWF, the biggest show we will have ever done. It's going to be a good one, ladies and gentlemen. So you definitely do not want to miss it. It will be on live. It will be live on premiere as per usual. Uh, of course, before that will be the pre-show 
uh, that will also include the end of season awards. The pre-show will have the end of season awards in there. Uh, so you don't want to miss that also. So make sure you guys tune into the Extreme Mania pre-show. Um, and also to the actual Extreme Mania show. Because uh, the Extreme Championship will also be defended on the pre-show. As well as uh, the Chad Baldwin Memorial Battle Royal. Um, of course that was created by management in honor of the late Chad Baldwin. Who, as we all know, unfortunately lost his life at the hands of the Masked Man. Who we now know was actually the brother of uh, Robert Riley. Um, <clears throat> who of course, both of them are now in jail, um, which means that, which is why Travis Tyler is, is now the owner of the XWF. Uh, but enough backstory. Uh, we are in the middle of an Extreme Championship match here. It is a ladder match. Of course, the only way to win is to climb the ladder and uh, grab the, the title that is hanging over the ring. Look at this belly to belly from Michael Murder there. <clears throat> now Michael Murder. Oh man. He's tossing the fire scroll like it was nothing. <clears throat> Ooh, leg drop to the arm. Now Michael Murder is going to go up top here. He's up on the top rope telling Fire Skull to get up. Michael went for something and barely caught him there at the end. <clears throat> oh, Fire Skull sitting in the corner there. Close line in the back. <clears throat> and Michael Murder taunting a bit here. I don't know if I'd be doing that if I were him because uh, Fire Skull is uh, like one of the better competitors we have here. Of uh, course, a former United States champion, former extreme champion in his own right. Um, <clears throat> but now a ladder will be introduced into this match finally. Double axe handle take down there. Oh man. <clears throat> and now Michael Murder gonna try and get the the title off the uh, the hook there that is hanging from. Still trying to get it down while Fire Skull tries to prevent it. <coughs> and finally, Michael Murder giving up here. Uh, kind of stuck on the top of the ladder. Oh, my goodness. That punch sends him down there. Oh, but Michael Murder got the double feet. Right to the chest of Fire Skull there. And Michael Murder once again going up top, but hold on. He's going further. Oh my goodness, look at Michael Murder. Whoa. My, I'm surprised he got up that quickly. Michael Murder just jumped off of that ladder. That is, wow. <clears throat> and there goes Fire Skull. Uh, this might be the perfect amount of time that Fire that, uh Michael Murder needs to grab this championship down. Uh, Fire Skull trying to get back up to his feet here. Using the ropes to help him up. And Fire Skull now, now back up to his feet. And he's going to find the ladder as well. Oh, and the four on there. And just shoving Michael Murder down. And now Fire Skull going to try and get this uh, championship off of the, the hook here. Well, Michael Murder struggles uh, to even get back up after being shoved off the ladder like he was. Still trying to get it down, but Michael Murder now back up to his feet very quickly there. Uh, and look at Michael Murder here. Oh my gosh, swinging neckbreaker off of the ladder. And you can hear the crowd now chanting, this is awesome. 
And this is awesome. Now Michael Murder trying to get the title down. Uh, Fires go back up to his feet again here. Now Fires are going to climb the ladder once again. Oh, and a gut punch. Multiple gut punches here from Fireskull trying to take Michael Murder out here. Oh, and the right hand just sends him flying down. And now Fireskull trying one more time to get this title down. And he does it. So Fireskull is your new extreme champion. What a match that was. These two just duped it out here tonight. <clears throat> it's all for that championship right there that is now in the hands of Fire Skull. But up next we have women's action as Dottie will be taking on Tiffany Strong here one on one tonight. Of course, uh, Dottie we know will be facing uh, Casey Miller at Extreme Mania for her championship. But uh, Tiffany Strong is her opponent here tonight. Hopefully giving uh, Dottie some sort of momentum here heading into her match at Extreme Mania. Here is the Fight Women's Champion now. Uh, going out as alone here tonight. Uh, no one to be with her at ringside. Tiffany Strong. We haven't seen very much of her as of late, but she is here tonight to face the Fight Women's Champion. set for one-on-one -on -one action here tonight. Here we go, the bell has been rung and look at Dottie starting things off here strong. I mean, there is a reason she is the fight women's champion. Oh man. Tiffany Strong in control here. <clears throat> Tiffany thrown into the corner, went for the double knees, but Tiffany dodged it there. Kick to the stomach from Tiffany Strong, and a kick to the leg as well. Multiple kicks to the leg. Now thrown into the ropes. Slid under, leapfrog. Another leapfrog, Dottie catches herself. Ooh, Dottie with a knee to the stomach there. Now look at Dottie. Huge headbutt there. Taking out Tiffany. Now picking her back up here. Slide under there. Leapfrog. Ooh, and a toehold takedown there from Dottie, and just walking across her like a tightrope. Of course, Psycho Circus, uh, the ring is their playground, I guess. Uh, one count there, though, from Tiffany Strong kicking out at one there. Oh, man, drop kick right to the side of the face there. Ooh, and a forearm, multiple forearms here from Dottie. Oh man, face first into the mat. 
Oh, and just raking the booze across the face there. And Dottie is uh, in a bad way here. <clears throat> oh, going to the corner. Now look at this. Hanging her from the top rope here. Oh man, That's the boot right to the face there. Now picking back the uh, picking Dottie back up here. Oh man, that had to hurt. That huge impact there. You could even hear it. <clears throat> Kick right to the back there, but Dottie kick, kips right back up. And a low kick to the shin there. Kick to the back. Dottie back in control of this match. Ooh, got a kick there. <coughs> oh, and the clothesline sends Dottie out of the ring. Now, Tiffany Strong going outside the ring as well. Picking Dottie back up. Oh, face first onto the, the LED board of, of the, the ring there. That's the... Uh, hardest part of the ring right there, that, that plastic uh, right up against that metal. And again, just back first into that LED board. And a take down there from Tiffany. And these two are just fighting on the outside here, of course. They got to be careful not to get counted out. <coughs> Referee is at a count of four. Five. Ooh, Dottie missed that uh, forearm. Got a kick to the gut in, in, in the turn there. Now Tiffany thrown back into the ring after a count of six, and Dottie following right after. Now Tiffany thrown into the corner, went for the drop kick, but again dodged by Tiffany Strong. Now Tiffany taking down Dottie. Looked like she was trying to get a guillotine of sorts locked in there, but uh, Dottie did cause a rope break. Oh, face first into that turnbuckle. Oh, and just the driving that shoulder right into the abdomen of Dottie. <clears throat> now Tiffany Strong looking for something here. Big boot there from Tiffany Strong. Now dragging Dottie to the center of the ring here. Going for the pin. Will she be able to knock off the champion here too? Three and Tiffany Strong has actually pinned the uh, women's champion, the fight women's champion. Um, man, what does that mean for the future here for Tiffany Strong? Wow, what a victory here for Tiffany Strong here tonight. Knocking off the fight women's champion. Um, yeah, that's... Wow. Wow. <clears throat> Huge victory for her tonight. Um, but yeah, so that's not good for Dottie walking into her match at Extreme Mania. Of course, she will be defending her Fight Women's Championship against Casey Miller. Um, and walking in after a loss, that's not going to be fun for Dottie. She's got to get her head back in the game if she wants to retain her championship. Uh, but again, uh, Tiffany Strong does win this match. She does take uh, the victory from the Fight Women's Champion. But up next... We have our main event, and it is a tag team match. <laughs> the winners of this match uh, get to face the game over at Extreme Mania for the uh, uh, Fight Tag Team Championships, and the losers have to face the Psycho Circus at Extreme Mania. But now here come the Blood Brothers. <clears throat> This, this is going to be a big match for both of these two teams because uh, if, if they win the match, they get a fight tag team championship opportunity, but if they lose, they're forced to face the Psycho Circus, a team nobody wants to get in the ring with.
But, uh, of course, we're glad to see that the Blood Brothers back on the same page here, seemingly. Um, they are looking to earn themselves another uh, fight tag team championship opportunity, possibly uh, becoming two-time champions. <clears throat> These two are just having a blast here during their entrance. <clears throat> Team R and R, Ramirez and Reeves, Reeves and Ramirez. Of course, the team of JJ Ramirez and Tyler Reeves. They have uh, made their names here uh, in the tag team division as of late. Uh, they've even they've challenged Game Over uh, the most recently. So uh, let's, let's see who wins this match here tonight. Of course, again, the winners will be facing Game Over at. For the fight tech championships. And again, we just have to face the cycle champions uh, at, at Extreme Mania as well. So, both of these teams will get an Extreme Mania match for sure, uh, which is uh, good in its, on, on, on its own. Um, but, Titan match is what they want. It's either going to be a championship match or an exhibition match. Uh, so, uh, obviously, they want the championship match. Of course, the, but the winner uh, has to. Oh, and James Smith just tagged himself in at the very beginning of the match. I don't know what that, what that's all about. Um, but anyway, this match is about to get underway. Uh, the bell has been rung. Oh, spinning heel kick to start things off here. Um, but yeah, of course, the winners facing Game Over, the longest reigning fight tag team champions champions the XWF has ever had. Um, so that will be relatively hard to knock them off, but it's not impossible. And, uh, Ramirez went for a kick there, but James Smith dodged it. Oh! <coughs> inverted atomic drop there from uh, James Smith. And now hanging him from the top rope. What is James Smith looking for here? Oh, and just dragging that the kick pad he has on against the face of J.J. Ramirez. <clears throat> now rolling over Ramirez here, going for the pin already. And it's just a one count. Of course, both these men or both of these teams desperate for this tag team op tag team championship opportunity. Uh, especially Ramirez and Reeves, a team who have yet to uh, claim gold. Uh, either in tag team action or in singles action for either of these members. Uh, neither of them have ever held a championship here in XWF. Uh, so this is one that they desperately need. Of course, we've seen uh, Team R&R &R, uh, face Game Over before, and every time we've seen them face each other, Game Over has been victorious, but if they do happen to win this match tonight, maybe something will change. Maybe they will be able to knock off Game Over at Extreme Mania. Uh, you never know until you get there. But again, we still we don't know who's going to be facing Game Over yet uh, until this match, uh, until the bell rings. Now look at JJ Ramirez stun gun there. <clears throat> on that top rope. Now tag's finally made. Uh, Tyler Reeves will make his way into this match. He is fresh. Uh, James Smith is not. Oh, man. Huge cutter there from, from Tyler Reeves. Stopping the, the knee of James Smith. Oh, and look at this. Inverted figure four here. 
locked in on James Smith. Uh, James Smith does uh, get out of it here. Uh, that could have ended a lot worse for James Smith and the Blood Brothers. <coughs> Forearm smash takedown there from Tyler Reeves, but now John Smith is legal. John Smith also uh, very fresh in this match. Hits a spear on J.J. Ramirez and a running knee as well. Oh, but look at Ramirez with the arch back suplex. Again, both of these teams desperate for this tag team championship opportunity. Oh, and a big uppercut in the corner there from Reeves. Picking up John Smith. Look at this right here. My goodness. Just flattening John Smith. Now, picking up. Oh, and a stun gun there from, from Reeves. Oh, man, a double foot stomp there right to the, the gut. Picking up John Smith. Going into the corner once again here. And another uppercut. James Smith trying to get involved here, but the referee's stopping him. <clears throat> as Tyler Reeves throws uh, John Smith into the corner once again here. This time looking for something different, driving him face first into that middle turnbuckle. Tyler Reeves trying to get the crowd pumped up here as well. And another uppercut from Tyler Reeves. Now look at Tyler Reeves, he's gonna go for it again. Oh my gosh. Oh, he's got the submission locked in, but uh, luckily John Smith had his foot under the bottom rope already. And a tag made back to J.J. Ramirez. And J.J. just immediately is going to go for a pin on John Smith here. One, two, Oh my goodness, just like that. <clears throat> wow. So it will be Team R&R &R facing game over for the Fight Tag Team Championships at Extreme Mania. You can see John Smith, of course, obviously upset. Um, they did not win, but they will be facing uh, the Psycho Circus at Extreme Mania now that we know who will be facing game over. And James Smith seems to be upset with his brother. This is not what we want to see here. But anyway, that's all for tonight, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, thank you all for watching, and we'll see you on battle tomorrow. Good night, everybody. Oh.